what the fuck? Snooze fest. Literal snooze fest. This gun is, I, bro, I cannot figure out any type of way to make this gun any type of good. But for the sake of this video, I'm going to show you guys what I was using in. I have been using SOCOM Eliminator. Usually it does something, but with this gun, it does absolutely nothing. Takedown barrel, you know, increase the effective damage range. That's kind of what that does, you know what I'm saying? We use this to increase the hip fire because most of the time you can't control the recoil. You know what I'm saying? You just gotta, you just gotta spray it out. Just a little bit of grrr. Next up for the underbear, we got the field agent grip. It's not like it does anything. You know what I'm saying? It might reduce a little bit of recoil, but this gun's chalk, man. We use the jungle style mag. As far as the handling goes, we use the airborne elastic wrap. Now I'm saying increase the ADS time. You know, you can do a little bit of drop shot if you want to. Also gives you 90% flinch resistance, which is pretty cool. Last but not least, we use the SAS combat stock. Now I'm saying it lets you move a little bit faster while you shoot. It's basically like a regular stock but you guys are gonna need all the help you can get with this gun i honestly didn't want to make a video on this gun with like the whole overpower class series or anything of that sort because this gun is literally a meme so yeah recently we had a pretty good update we had this nice little motherland uh mosh pit update which is pretty cool end up taking out the nuketown 24 7 place i think they're gonna bring it back on the 16th along with like double xp and stuff which was gonna be pretty cool so we're gonna be grinding that out probably gonna be playing the motherland uh mosh pit for a bit you know it's gonna be pretty lit see how that is but as far as this weapon goes man ffar is garbage like when i say garbage i mean like <laughs> Like, honestly, I don't really know too much to say about the FFAR. Like, you can try and put a whole bunch of different attachments on it, but at the end of the day, it's just, it just doesn't get better. Either they fucking buff something through the roof and make it the new meta, or they just completely destroy shit. Like, it's, it's horrible. Take things back to how it was in the beta, you know what I'm saying? Shit was broken, things were busted, but it was all just fun. Like, we were equally OP as hell, so I'd say we just run it at from the place we were at in the beta. Let me know you guys' opinion about this game down below inside the comment section. Me personally, it's broken. It has a lot of things that need to be updated on it, but I honestly want to know how you guys feel about the game. I go to Diamond FFAR, you know what I'm saying? It's a little cute. Kind of cute. You know I'm saying it's nothing too crazy. And I get sniped. <laughs> ah, bro, listen. I was just trying to show off my gun, man. And other COD news, we pretty much got this new Warzone update coming out. I'm actually really interested to see where they're going to go with the whole Warzone thing. I don't know if it's going to be like a completely new map, if they're just going to be using the same Modern Warfare engine. I don't know how it's going to go. If it's anything like Dirty Bomb, I think I'm going to enjoy it a lot. If it's anywhere near like the way the Dirty Bomb is set up, I feel like I'm going to enjoy it a lot. I like the way that the gun, I like the guns run or how they feel in Dirty Bomb, personally. I know not everyone's a fan of Dirty Bomb, but me personally, I just enjoy it. But definitely be on the lookout for a Dirty Bomb video soon. Me, Awesome, T, and Kronos ended up recording some stuff for it or whatever. It was definitely a vibe. We had a lot of fun recording. I guess next up we'll do the snipers and see where that goes. I feel like the snipers are gonna be a bit of a challenge, but you know, I snipe, so I'm gonna be able to hold it down. You know what I'm saying, be able to hold it down a little bit, you know, hold my own with the snipers. But as far as the FFAR goes, there's so many different options for you guys to choose from. I honestly wouldn't 
go with this gun. Like the gun doesn't hit hard enough. The bullets shoot out too fast. The recoil, it's manageable now, but it's not, it's, it's just, I, I don't like it. So yeah, let me know what you guys think about the FFAR down below in the comment section. Also, let me know what you guys think about the updates that are coming in the future for the game. Let me know what you guys would like to see, some things you wouldn't like to see, some of the changes you guys would like to see made to the game. So yeah, I'm going to wrap this video up here, man. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you guys a nice little thumbs up. And if you guys are new to this channel, make sure you guys subscribe, yo. Turn on those notifications, all that goodness, all that greatest, man. This is me, Sax of King Stacks.